Ronnie here from Southern Food Junkie. Today we're going to do our demo cook on the Orion cooker. I got everything pretty much set in place. We're going to cook a, we're going to cook a chicken. I brined it overnight with a combination of salt and sugar. And uh, it's inside drip drying and I've used the poultry stand that comes with the Orion cooker. I'm also going to throw one slab of uh, baby back ribs on there. Uh, that I'm using some uh, Wasai's uh, smoky rub on. Really good rub. Uh, and I'll show you what I got so far. Chip soaking here. Uh, I'm going to use hickory on this. I like hickory the best. Uh, and I got my racks here. I'm only going to install one rack. Charcoal in the top here. I got charcoal around the edge. And then after my chips finish soaking, I'm going to put the chips around the drip pan there. Now I'm actually putting uh, two of these, all three of these uh, rib hangers in here. Uh, I'm only going to use two of them. Now I actually sp split my uh, rack of ribs in half because I didn't know how, uh, with the poultry standing there, how they would hang. So that's kind of where I'm at. We're about to uh, fire this up. We're about to put our chips in, put our, uh, put our bottom grill in there, the bottom grate, and then we're going to put our rack of ribs on here. Get everything in here, lid closed, and then we're gonna uh, fire it up. And what we're gonna do the instructions not to open the lid to trust their cook times. So I went back and looked, and the ribs take an hour and ten minutes, and the chicken takes an hour and ten minutes. So we're gonna let them go for about an hour, ten minutes, and then we'll pull the lid at that point, make sure it's done. So uh, we're going we're cooking a little bit more than just a chicken, so it may take just a little bit longer. So uh, we'll see how it goes. But we won't we won't try to trust their their uh, their time. We'll actually set a timer on our phone. All right, we got them in here. And I tried to get it where none of them was touching. You can see uh, I got some space between to allow the air to flow through. So hopefully this will work out. We'll see what happens. minutes you can see all of our uh, charcoal is ashed over the cooker is up to temperature I don't know if you can hear that but you can hear it in there crackling you can see a little bit of the steam coming out right there a little bit of the smoke another hour we'll be eating some chicken All right, guys, hour and a half, hour and 10 minutes is almost up. You can see where uh, some of the liquid has seeped out of there. And it's burning as it goes down the side of it. The pressure of the inside is forcing the juices out. Hopefully, we're going to have a delicious set of rack of ribs and a turkey. Let's get it out of there. We're going to use our Thermal Pro Instant Read Thermometer to check the temperature of the bird and the ribs. Make sure they're in a safe range. And here goes our timer. Alright, here we go. Uh, 
that's a chicken, not a turkey. I'm sorry. I mean, he made a chicken. Inside of it, after we cook, we'll let it cool off, and then we'll get that drip pan out of there tomorrow. Oh. Hey guys, I hope you enjoy this review of the Orion cooker. I tasted that bird, and it was excellent. Uh, hadn't got to the ribs yet. They looked like they were pretty tender from uh from when I got them out of there. I've uh, rolled them up in tin foil, and I'm just gonna put them in the oven with the oven off, cause uh, we still got a little bit before we gonna eat, and I'm gonna let the the meat rest a little bit. So uh, go and check them out. Check their uh, website out, OrionCooker.com. See what you think. Uh, since I posted the first video, I've gotten a lot of uh, positive uh, comments from from people who owns them and say they love the meat. Uh, so uh, get, in, get in there and try it out. So far, I like it. It was very easy to cook on. I didn't have to maintain it. I just put the uh, put the charcoal in here, a little bit of wood chips in there, and that was it. And an uh, hour and 10 minutes, ready to go. I checked my bird. It was 165. My ribs were like 175. So uh, they, they were a little bit on the higher end. Um, it was supposed to be for three racks of ribs in here, but um, like I said, yeah, work, it works good. Check them out. Thank y'all for watching.